Hey, what's going on YouTube? Today I'm going to be showing you how to speed up your eye device. Um, this isn't going to really turn like your Apple Touch 4G into an iPhone 4S or an iPad 2 or anything, you know, like that fast. But it's basically going to make you like run your iPod or iPhone or iPad like a little bit more smoother and a little bit more, uh, I guess you could say, like faster. And uh, that's basically it. So let's get started. First thing I guys want you to do is open up City and wait for it to load. Once you guys have City loaded up, what I want you to do is to add a new repo. And so go into the Manage tab, hit on Sources, then hit Edit at the top right, and then Add on the top left. And then you're going to add the Insanely I repo, which is repo dot insanely I. dot com. Once you guys have that, hit add source. I'll display it on the screen if you can't see it now, and then I'll also put it in the description. I'm going to hit cancel because I already have it. Once you guys have that source added, you're going to hit on the search tab, and you're going to type in clean up crap, and then uh, in parentheses, it's going to say CUC right there. Let's go ahead and click on it. You're going to hit install, and then it's going to say uh, continue queuing, uh, like right, you know, right there. Uh, you're going to tap on that and then you're going to hit back and then you're going to type in another thing which is mobile terminal you're going to get the new one so in parentheses it's going to say new you're going to install that one uh, but the thing is you guys can either stop there and install both of those things and it'll install them all or you can install the next thing which is a, uh, it's going to clean up all the languages which is stuff you basically don't even need and if you do want that, you can type in lang2, the number 2, and then ez. You're going to hit on that. Right there. And then you can hit install and confirm, and it'll install everything you just uh, you just went through. Alright guys, once you got everything installed, just hit the home screen. And then you're going to, well I'm just closing out of that for whatever reason. And then hit terminal and wait for it to load up once you guys are on mobile terminal you want to type in exactly what I put and what you gotta put first is a uh, login L -O -G -I -N, and then hit return it's gonna come with a login screen you're gonna type in uh, I mean root R-O-O-T and then you're gonna hit return again and it's gonna come with a password now if you didn't like if you did change your SSH password then you you would know what it is so type in that but if it's the default one it would be alpine a l p i n e and then you'll come up with this right here and what you want to type in is c u c and what this is going to do is basically clear all the stuff you don't really need it's kind of the same thing on windows as you can see here as you guys can see i can type in uh, run in the start menu and then i can hit that and then i can type in um, whatever that thing, uh, percentage and then temp and then percentage again. And then I fit, if I hit enter, it's going to bring up all the stuff I really don't need. So I can go ahead and hi highlight all that stuff and delete it because it's useless. I don't really need it. It's doing the same thing on the Apple Touch. All right, guys, once it's finished, it'll say done. Uh, but if you guys did install the Lang 2 Easy, then you can do what I'm going to do right now. But if you didn't, you can just leave it alone, hit the home button, and be done with it. Uh, but if you did type in Lang, L-A-N-G, 2, E-Z, and then hit return. Now this will take a little bit longer than what you did the first time. Maybe about, I don't know, maybe uh, 30 seconds or longer or something. And so that's basically doing the same thing, but it's removing some language packs so it will make it more smoother. And so... Uh, I'm just going to wait for this to load, and then it'll say finish. So as you can see, it's done, and there you guys go. That's how you uh, make your iPod Touch smoother, and it'll work a little bit more faster now. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please comment, rate, subscribe. Check out my website, www.jbjhacks.webs.com. Uh, be sure to follow me on Twitter at jailbreakerjake, and don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video.